let's go ahead and um, lift the car up remove the front wheel front wheel is removed now we have removed the cowl that is held by a couple pins here and there we have this one removed that's our uh, brake fluid reservoir we're gonna go ahead and undo this cap because once we're pushing the piston on the caliber back we need to uh, release the pressure uh, from the reservoir since we are replacing rotors and uh, brake pads then uh, we'll have to go ahead and take off the caliber completely I'm gonna go ahead and make my life easy I'm on the passenger side the bolts are right here and one in the bottom I'm gonna turn the steering wheel all the way to the right brake caliber itself is held by 18 millimeter bolts one in the top and the other one here in the bottom let's go ahead and undo those make sure to get the bungee cord ready to hold that brake uh, caliber up you can tie it up here on the strut for example caliber bolts are removed from the spindle to 18s also gonna go ahead and break those or remove those 40 millimeter ones so we can separate the uh, caliber okay 14s out on this side as well you can just use a flat screwdriver to break this part away and separate it here we have it we have that one separated just like this that will go ahead and make it easy to replace your pads now we can access the rotor let's knock that rotor off we have a might be Torx 30 or 40 that goes there Torx 40 is the correct size unbolt this grab it with two hands not to knock it on your legs before installing the rotor you can use a wire brush and clean up the hub area which connects with the brake uh, rotor okay that's good enough our bolt 4040 is back in next up we can go ahead and take our compression tool and one of the old uh, brake uh, pads to compress this piston back i'm using a simple brake piston caliber tool using an old brake pad and then we just go ahead and screw it all the way back in piston is pushed all the way back you can give it a little clean up if you want use a wire brush you can go ahead and clean up the brackets bracket surface where the brake uh, pads slide we are using the Rolas cold products advanced car quest product was in here before CarQuest Gold once come already with the new bracket bolts with some Loctite on it. That's very nice. Take your brake caliber bracket from inside, push them towards the outside. I will be needing two hands to do so. Brake pads are installed. Next thing, you can go ahead and install these pads this bracket on the rotor 80 millimeter bolts going in now the bracket is bolted down now we can take this piston or brake caliber slide it over use our new bolts for that tighten them down okay our rotor and pads is replaced all you have to do is put your wheel back on five 17 millimeter lock bolts and you're done we are gonna go ahead and do exactly the same thing on the other side thank you for watching like and subscribe